here at the Vibe back with another video. This your favorite cutie with the big booty back at it again. talking about it so i want to know in the comments do y'all think he was wrong do y'all think he was right my opinion sierra divine i don't think he was wrong because sometimes you gotta cuss out these kids let's just be real it's not the 90s no more it's 2021 you gotta cuss them out a lot of y'all need to be cussed out honestly and it shows you're spoiled your mom and daddy need to whoop your butts. Your mom and daddy need to threaten to break your neck or snap your fingers, whatever. Because it shows you're spoiled. The Bible even says, spare the rod, spoil the child. I still support Kirk Franklin. I'm going to love him no matter what. That shows that he's only human. We always think these gospel artists are perfect, but they're human. They go through the same thing we do in our day-to-day -day life. Y'all worried about Kirk Franklin cussing out his son, but do y'all remember last year or the year before the pastor that got caught on camera performing oral sex? Y'all didn't say nothing about that. Y'all didn't have a big uproar, uproar about that. But as soon as Kirk Franklin say, I'm going to break your fucking neck, it's, oh my God, why did he say that? Why does this man have to apologize for his fathering skills? A lot of y'all say stuff way worse than that to your kids, but y'all don't, y'all don't come up pub publicly apologize. So why does Kirk Franklin have to? Gospel artist or not, he's still a human. He's still going to make mistakes and he's still a father. He's a father first before anything. And that meant his son ain't no teenager. That's a grown ass man. Let's be real. He said his son finna be 33. So yeah, he had to take it way out in left field so his son could understand I'm not the one to quit. I said what I said. If anybody disagree, that's your opinion. Opinions are welcome on my channel. I don't care. But my opinion is I love it. I'm here for it. He had to do what he had to do to let his son know, I'm tired of your, your mess. In his apology, he said they've been dealing with family issues for years. And then his son only recorded the conversation he wanted to record. He said he called the family therapist. They were on three-way, but his son didn't record that. He tried to record the bad part for clout. But you only end up embarrassing yourself. Because maybe your daddy need to threaten you. Maybe so. A lot of y'all are spoiled in this shows. A lot of y'all need to be cussed out in this shows. I said what I said. Thank you and have a good day. disrespected in that conversation and I lost my temper and I said words that are not appropriate and I'm sincerely sorry to all of you I sincerely apologize I want you to know as a father that during that conversation I called the family therapist and got that therapist on the phone to try to help he never played that part of the recording I'm not perfect Please keep me and my 
family.